The group calls themselves Patriots, and they sent out a call to action via Facebook asking for volunteers to help secure the border and close down crossings starting in Laredo. However, if they make their way down to the Rio Grande Valley, some people say they won't be welcomed with open arms. This call to action was posted on the Patriots Information Hotline on Facebook. It's calling all Texas and national militia to unite to close down all border crossings. Quote, operation complete when border fence is in place and secure. Hidalgo County Interim Sheriff Eddie Guetta tells Action 4 News militia groups from as far as New York have reached out to him, but says they are not welcomed. I, I think it's a bad idea. And I don't welcome. The sheriff worries that militia groups will use drastic measures to stop family units and unaccompanied children from crossing the U.S.-Mexico border, many of whom have turned themselves into Border Patrol and local authorities. Guetta says he wants to avoid any public safety risk. I believe this, this particular group was quoted in a video saying, you know, just point, point a gun at them at their head and tell them to turn around and go back. Well, you know, that's, that's, that's gonna, going to, um, to have some consequences. Guetta says if someone were to be hurt or shot, the aggressor would face charges. The idea of an armed militia along the Rio Grande didn't sit well with community activists who've been calling the surge a humanitarian crisis. Uh, saying that you know that they're going to shoot people if they if they don't cross back, uh, it's it's really ridiculous. Um, it's hateful. Uh, it, it's just you know, racist. Enough law enforcement. We have enough. We have enough border patrol. If if we needed to call up people, I have I have the authority to call up. Uh, people, uh, but I, I don't. I don't see that in this situation. You know, that, that's that's not necessary. That video posted by the Patriots Militia Group has already been taken down and removed from YouTube. However, we did reach out to the group for comment via phone and email. However, we have not received a response. In the Hidalgo County Newsroom, I'm Ashley Custer. Action for news.